Hello everyone, welcome and thanks for joining us for the latest news and the latest updates. Wherever you are and where you're tuning in from, we are very grateful. But kindly don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification button for more of these updates. Bob Wine says in a quotation that we shall not allow Seven to build an empire using national wealth. Once again, thanks for joining us, but let's take more look into some of these details. The leader of National Unit Platform, Robert Chagulani, also known as Bob Wine, has said that for decades under President Museven's rule, nepotism has been the unwritten criteria upon which citizens are hired or appointed to public offices. Chagulani made the remarks while commenting on Museven's recent statement where he promised to employ sons and daughters of the rich to curb corruption in the country. Chagulani said, that Museven's revelation is a fact already well known to the public, adding that this is what has been going on for a very long time. Museven has for long personalized our country and runs it as though it were his personal home or property. Out of public resources, General Museven and his inner circle have built a private empire to enrich themselves at the expense of ordinary citizens that the vast majority of whom are poor, uh, he said in a statement. He, uh, he also stated that most of the descendants the president intends to deploy in public offices come from those families that have gained wealth through corruption or through opportunities denied to the rest of the citizens. He feigns ignorance about the fact that corruption is rampant today largely because of his leadership's policy of patting the back of government officials implicated in corruption scandals and after all it is usual his relatives and associates implicated as we saw in the 1997 junk choppers saga uh, that's what Bob Wine said and Bob Wine also noted as that Museven has been using the army to brutalize local fishermen claiming that the fishing industry is now family controlled by his family and business associates. He also added on saying that his relatives are running a monopoly of sorts in the most profitable businesses. They have amassed wealth grabbed poor people's land and are now in advanced stage of establishing an empire, he noted. Uh, Bobine also claimed that the key offices in ministries and public bodies are populated by Museven's inner circle. Chagulani said during the recent elections, Museven outdid himself by bribing some of his noob supporters to turn against him in exchange for material gain. He explained such happens when a ruler gathers absolute power around himself. Uh, our task is not yet complete. General Museven's statements spell doom for our nation. The poor people who are the vast majority must rise up and defend themselves from a small unpopular clique that is overfed and wealthy at the expense of all citizens. That's what His Excellency Robert Chagulani, also known as Bob Wine, said in one of his statements. Well, that is it for now. Thanks for watching. We'll keep on updating with more of this, but kindly don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification button.